On the twelfth day of Vlogmas, what a sandy mom had for you. Six guys to two guys. So how y'all doing? We're getting the we're getting the white stuff. I was hoping it would hold off till, you know, March. <laughs> Wishful thinking, huh? Anyhow, I hope you're all doing well. You must be. Don't hear much from anyone. I appreciate those who are still watching my videos. Um, I had some plan that I was going to talk about, but it went right out of my head because it just did. But anyhow, it is 12th day of Vlogmas. I hope I said it's 12th day. Um, my plan B, in case I forgot plan A, was to talk about makeup. I was watching some vlogs and people were, you know, how they do makeup tutorials. And I was wondering, what kind of stuff do you put on your face when you do makeup? Or do you do makeup? Or don't you do makeup? Or did you do makeup? Or ever in your life have you done makeup? Because I was watching someone and they did a pre-something, then they did a moisturizer. I feel like I talked about this already. Oh, well, if I did, I'm doing it again. <laughs> then they put on a concealer, then another kind of concealer over the concealer thing, which made no sense to me because you put one concealer, it's usually enough. Then they put on, oh, there's something behind my head. I don't know what it is, but it's making noise when I put my head back. Well, oh, well, it was not my stomach growling. It's something else, I guess. So anyhow, um... Oh, yeah, we we're on the concealer, and then they put, you know how I always refer to that, like, well, it's liquid makeup, I would call it gunky stuff. Um, so this person was putting on foundation, it's called foundation, that's the word, that liquid stuff is foundation, the gunky stuff, as I refer to it. So they were putting it on, but they had it in a, like, a palette, in a, like, uh, not too good English, in a palette. And they used, like, like a sponge. And they put it on like, um, hmm, I'm saying like a lot. I don't know how to describe it, but it wasn't liquid. It was like a solid thing, but it was kind of creamy. So it would almost be like, like, um, blush, but like creamy, not liquidy, moist. I don't know the word, creamy. So they put that on. I thought, wow, that would be nice, better than the yucky stuff that I don't like, I don't use it. Like I said, my makeup usually only when I'm in front of the phone camera, I'll put probably usually just uh, concealer and probably um, mascara. Maybe some eyeshadow, but I don't know. I don't want to put all the other extra stuff. But anyhow, um, have you ever used this kind of foundation? It looked quite interesting to me. And then they put on some powder after and what's funny is that powder, I remember being a little girl and seeing in people's bathrooms, Oil of Olay, which she used that as her moisturizer, as I say she was a moisturizer, and then this powder. It was a little round uh, box, and it had orange, mostly orange, I think it had orange and white, maybe some black and lettering, I don't remember. But anyhow, I just remember seeing that and thinking, well, when I grow up, I'll get to wear all that stuff because my mom never let me use makeup. Um, but I don't know if you know what I'm talking about, that little orange kind of thing. And inside had a little poofy thing where you put into the powder and then I guess you powder your face. I'm not quite sure about the powder thing. I've never used the powder thing. But I think um, the one person was saying, so they put it on after they put the goopy stuff, which wasn't goopy stuff, goofy. <laughs> this is all turning goofy goopy stuff so it doesn't shine so apparently when you put the foundation on there's some shine so you put some power powder on not to shine and then what else came next oh let me think what else did they do well then they did some um i might be getting the order wrong here but they did some eyebrow something to their eyebrows can't remember Three different things. Then they talked about, oh, what was it called? This thing, I don't think I mentioned before, but 
Um, I remember seeing girls do it. You, you have this contraption that looks like it hurts, and you squish your eyelashes in it. Eyelash extender, maybe? But she said she didn't use that anymore. She said she didn't like it. But um, then she did eyeshadow. Oh, my gosh. She did five or six different eyeshadows. And truly, I saw nothing that, like, when you look at it, it's like, wow. I'm not sure. So I know I, like, the rare occasion I do use eyeshadow. I might put, like, a little, um, another color. Like, I usually use champagne. I love CoverGirl champagne, but can't find it anywhere, of course. And the blush that I used to use, can't find it. Well, that's why I don't use it, but I have no reason to use any makeup because I don't go anywhere. But anyhow, um... So sometimes I might use like a a darker brown, um, kind of close to where you'd put eyeliner. Eyeliner is something I have never done. Well, when I was a model, I did. People did my makeup, but I personally did it because it is way too close to my eyeball. And as I mentioned before, I got this eyeball thing. I don't like eyeballs. Anyhow, I put it down there to kind of highlight it. So like I said, she was highlighting that area and highlighting, I think, the crease and something else. I didn't really see a difference. Um, and I think after that, I don't know anything else I left out. Maybe a finishing spray? I don't know. But to me, it seems like a lot to do. Boy, it would have to be some kind of real hot date or something to put all that goop on. But anyhow, I'm not making fun of her by any means. I'm just saying it's... It's fun to watch these makeup things. And of course people are doing it because then they link it below and you can buy it and then they make money off of it. But anyhow, I was just wondering, what is your makeup routine? What do you do? Like a full-on makeup or do you just put something on or do you go, oh, natural, 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 no, oh, natural. I don't know. I'm trying to have a little French flair there, but it's not working. Like I said, my mom never wore makeup and I remember at the end of her life, her skin was so soft and nice and beautiful because she never ruined it with makeup so anyhow if you want to mark down i know it's christmas time and everyone's busy shopping and traveling and having fun and whatever but if you have a chance put it down if not i'll never know and uh not not important but i just thought you know i, I was watching a few makeup things and i just thought it was interesting how different people use different stuff and has ever anyone ever used oil of Olay? moisturizer it comes in a bottle and it's got a pink liquid that's another thing i always notice at other people's houses is oil of olay and i kept thinking once i grow up i'm going to use that never have i yet used oil of olay but i was just wondering have you ever used it is it really this miraculous stuff that keeps your face looking so young but for now don't forget to subscribe like hit the notification bell share sharing is caring don't forget to pay it forward it feels good in your heart polly's heart and my heart, especially during the season of giving, if you can, help other people, especially the people that are in need, which nowadays seems to be everyone. But, you know, there are people that are even worse off. You can always find someone worse off, which is sad. And keep everyone in your purse, especially during this holiday season. Be kind to people and yourself and just enjoy life. Thanks for stopping by. And that's all for now. Bye, everyone. Well, it doesn't shut off. Here we go again. <laughs> this phone.